gingival recession. These can appear as localized or generalized gingival recession. Recession can occur with or without loss of attached tissue. Gingival recession may affect an accentuated sensitivity because of the exposed dentin. It can be assessed by an appearance of a long clinical tooth and varied proportion of the teeth when compared with adjacent teeth. Gingival recession is a problem affecting almost all middle and older age to some degree. Generalized Gum Recession <laughs> Gingival recession can be caused by periodontal disease, accumulation, inflammation, improper flossing, aggressive tooth brushing, incorrect occlusal relationships, and dominant roots. Bruxism Unfortunately, the damage caused by bruxism doesn't stop with the teeth. Teeth grinding can also cause severe gum recession because of the pressure put on the gums. By the motion. Treatment for bruxism typically includes wearing a customized mouth guard designed to keep your teeth apart as you sleep. Composite restoration is one of the least invasive methods of treating gum recession. It is also one of the most aesthetically pleasing because the resin can closely match the natural appearance of the teeth. Can gums grow back? Unfortunately, receding gums can't grow back. But you can take steps to prevent gum recession from worsening. Mild cases of gum recession may be improved with non-surgical treatments such as topical antibiotics, dental bonding, or orthodontics. In most instances, however, GUM recession surgery is needed to fully correct the problem. Thank you.